Okay, here we are. I've got another outlet I got in the backyard. Normally we have a water feature sitting here in the corner of the patio and it plugs in here and I want to be able to plug other stuff in as well, maybe some lights or something. So again, I've put in a weatherproof box. I'm using weatherproof grommets for the cables going in to make sure that everything's watertight and safe and protected out in the backyard. This outlet is not a GFI outlet, but this outlet comes off of the one I showed you before, which is GFI, so it's protected. Always use your testers to test your outlets. This one shows two yellow lights and no red, so I know this one's wired properly. By the way, all the cabling that I use, this is really tight. All the cabling that I use in the backyard, I make sure that all my cables are tied down nice and snug with staples so they don't get, they don't get pulled around and something's not gonna catch one and pull it and nick a cable or, uh, or nick the insulation. And the other important thing is, if you're buying cable to use, be careful what you're buying. Don't just buy anything off the hardware store shelf. If you're using pre-manufactured pre extension cords, make sure that you're using exterior grade extension cords, not interior grade extension cords. There's a difference. Make sure you use exterior, the kind you'd use for your lawnmower or your weed whacker. Secondly, if you're just buying cable to run your own, all cables have printed on them what they are. And this particular cable here says it's I don't know if there, you can see that on the, on the lens, but it says that it's uh, three, um, uh, three wire, 16 gauge. Um, nope, three wire, 14 gauge cable. And most importantly, right here, it says water resistant. That means this cable can be used outside safely. It is a 14 gauge cable, so I can use a fairly long run without, um, without the cable being compromised or, the, or the, the electricity or anything. I'm not getting into the details of that but I know this is a safe cable. When you look at the gauge of the cable, the three by 14, three by 16, whatever it is, three means three wire, hot, neutral, and ground. And the number, the other number, the 14 or the 16, is the gauge. You always wanna use the lowest number you can get for use out in the backyard. You'll have long runs, and you don't want the cables heating up. So always try to use uh, 3-14 or 3-12 if you can get it never use 3-18 or 3-20 out in the backyard and again look for the water resistant printing on the uh, jacket of the cable that'll tell you it's safe for use outdoors thanks for watching onwatergarden.com